It is a women's 115 pound matchup between Paige Van Zandt or Tale of the Tape for this strawweight fight. Van Zant is 23, Koval Kavich is 32. The rest of the numbers are nearly identical. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC strawweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This woman is a mixed martial artist, only professional record up. Ready first. Ready. Well, they have cleared out the hall wood. They have made way for the octagon as we get underway here at Toyota Center in Houston, Texas. Kovalkiewicz gets caught with that punch. Oh, nice inside leg kick. Splits the guard and connects with the punch. Oh, she's doing a real nice job with these leg kicks, Joe. I've lost count in terms of how many have landed this round. Her opponent's pace has really weighed now. There's that jab. So both girls landing right out of the shoot. Oh, very nice. So Volkiewicz gets caught with that punch. So more output, at least in the early going. Slip and counter by Carolina Kovalkiewicz. Oh, she continues to attack that bloody cheek, Joe. Her face is an absolute mess. Well, you know about the offense, but how about the defense? Overhand blocked by Kovalkiewicz. And she lands a nice kick. Tries a big hook to the head, but misses. Nice knee landed there by Kovalkiewicz. Good exchange there. Beautiful right leg kick there. Nice. Good job of timing this combination of strikes here. Hard left. Oh, she blocks the punch. That one hurt. Good shot. All of those are blocked. No! Oh! Huge right hand! This could be it right here. Straight right hand, but she misses. Well, she is clearly gassed out at this point of the fight. The stamina is low, and even when she misses a strike, that is an exhausting effort as well. So, not a good look for her here. Oh, connecting with a series of punches here. Oh! oh. This could be it! She might try to finish this fight here. Oh, straight right! Doing an excellent job blocking here. Oh! What a leg kick! Nice kicks. Well, she got cracked to the head there, Joe. She continues to be vulnerable to that strike by leaning in, almost moving into the strike at this point in time. She's got to get her head off of that center line. Whenever you see a fighter's legs stiffen up like that, that's not a good sign. Oh, how about the multiple strikes landing here? That is a serious offensive barrage. That's a clean left hand. Oh, that kick is good by Van Zandt. Second round, straight ahead. There's a nice leg kick. And here's another beautiful leg kick. Some real clean striking on display in that round. Brittany Palmer is in the building. All right, second round underway. And she caught the kick. Oh, powerful right leg kick. Oh, she connected flush. How about that shin? Very nice leg kick there by Carolina Kovalkiewicz. Oh, she checked that one. Nice punch by Kovalkiewicz. Landing a good series of strikes here. Whoa! Van Zandt gets caught by the straight punch. Wow! This could be it right here. Oh! Huge kick misses. Nice leg kick. Oh, the 
bruise on the outside of her thigh. That is crimson now, Joe. Best of luck getting out of bed tomorrow. Wow, what a back and forth exchange. She blocked the punch. Kovalkiewicz is circling now towards the left. Nice body take. Try to establish that jab. So again, she absorbs more damage to the head here, Joe. She's gonna have to make some adjustments. That head is sticking out right into her opponent's range and firmly on the center line. Let's see if she can make some adjustments here. Oh! This could be it! Oh! Oh! Back to the feet! Big shots! Hard straight punch! Able to check that kick as well. Well, she was a little bit hesitant in round one, but she has certainly picked up the pace here in this second round. It took her a while to find her range. She's in a strong striking rhythm now. Oh, nice job defensively to get the hands up and avoid further damage there in and around that cut. Body kick now by Carolina Kovalkiewicz. Effective use of the jab there by Van Zandt. Nice straight left and a right hand behind it. This could be it right here. Vicious combinations. Oh! She got tagged again. She's hurt. Oh, beautiful kick there. This could be it. Oh, she got her. Oh! oh. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Knee to the body. Nice elbow. We gotta fight, folks. some of the action here. And here's a big strike to the head that stuns. And here's another devastating shot to, and you can see both fighters giving and taking it. You ready to fight? Ready. Third round underway. That last round was an all out roll. If they continue like that in this round, someone's getting knocked out. Nice. Even when you block those, they'll still stun you. Oh, she just continues to land a high volume of strikes here, really just like she did in the previous round, and she does not seem to be slowing down at all. Van Zandt gets lit up by that straight punch. Going to the leg kick now, and it's there. Nice job by Kovalkiewicz. gets up and decides to take this fight back to its feet, despite having a seemingly dominant position on the ground. Another shot. Oh, oh, Van Zandt is down. shaking after that slam, Joe. Van Zandt gets up and decides to take this fight back to the feet, despite having a dominant position on the ground. Beautiful inside leg kick. Splits the guard, connects with the punch there, Joe. Just over three minutes to go in our third and final round. Oh, she leaned right into that uppercut, Joe. Not a good look there. We'll see if she can make some adjustments here. And those adjustments would start by just getting those gloves and getting those hands up to prevent any further damage. Oh! Strike there is blocked. Nice job by the defense. Wow! And she's down! She's out! Oh. Unbelievable! Excellent timing here. Big left hand for the victory. Well, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. Absolutely flush on the land, and I'm not even sure her opponent saw it coming, Joe. So sometimes it's the strike you don't see coming that spells your fate. 
and ultimately it goes in the books as a big knockout win for her here tonight. Let's take a look at it from another angle here. This is the one that causes the knockdown and the subsequent follow-up strikes for the knockout. Great angle here. Oh, man. K.O. And there she is after the huge knockout here tonight. What a moment for this fighter. You can't help but feel good for her here tonight. All right, here's Bruce Buffer now Ladies with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, the Beans called the stock for this contest. At two minutes, 46 seconds of the third round, declaring the winner by knockout, 12-gauge Paige Van So the celebration is on for PDZ, and rightfully so, you can argue, this was her cleanest performance to date. There has been a ton of skill development for Paige Van Zandt. She has clearly made the most of her time in the gym and maximized her UFC experience. It looks as though for Paige Van Zandt, the best is yet to come.